Hello, and welcome to the first video in this Introduction to ShareGate Migrate series. My name is Patrick, and I'm a Solution Advisor for ShareGate. This video series will help you get off the ground fast and jumpstart your testing phase if you're in a trial, or help start planning and executing your migration project if you just purchased your first ShareGate subscription. So, you just signed up for a trial or purchased ShareGate Migrate. What's the first step? The beginning of your ShareGate journey starts with the creation and activation of your ShareGate home account. You will receive an email asking you to finalize the creation of your account after signing up for a trial. If you just purchased ShareGate, the account creation email will be sent to the email address flagged as the end user. Follow the steps in the email to complete the account creation. You should then be able to access ShareGate home by navigating to ShareGate website and clicking on Login. From here, you can download the ShareGate Migrate tool or access Protect if you've purchased it alongside your ShareGate Migrate subscription. From the top left, you will be able to manage your new workspace. If you are a partner or consultant working with multiple end users, you will be able to see and be part of multiple workspaces at once. There are two types of memberships for your workspace, workspace owner and contributor. As a workspace owner, you will be able to go to workspace settings, change the name of your workspace, as well as manage other members and your subscription or renewal details directly from the platform. In the members section, you will be able to view all currently active and invited members for this workspace. Clicking on the option icons allows you to manage each member, determining if their account is a workspace owner or contributor, assigning product access for both ShareGate Migrate and Protect if you've purchased it, as well as the number of machine activations assigned for this account. You can also click on Revoke Product Access to remove any and all access for both ShareGate Migrate and Protect, or Remove from Workspace, which would also revoke product access, but also disassociate this account from your workspace. A contributor account would only be able to manage the machine activations granted to them by the workspace owners and would not be able to manage their own product access settings or any other workspace members access. Clicking on Add Members button at the top allows you to invite new users to this workspace. You can enter their email address, choose which role they will be assigned, and the number of machine activations assigned to their profile. If the recipients do not have an active ShareGit Home account, they will be prompted to create one. The subscription section is only available to workspace owners and will allow you to view your current plan as well as manage your renewals or upgrades directly from the platform. Once your account is set up and you have installed the ShareGate Migrate tool, you will be prompted on first open to log in with your ShareGate Home account. If your ShareGate Home account is assigned to multiple workspaces, you will have to pick the correct one for this specific use. This will utilize one of the machine activations assigned to your account within the selected workspace and enable the use of the ShareGate Migrate application. 